Year 16 with the Grizzlies in Memphis. Media Day was today. Ron, impressions? Well, I think the theme was more like uh, it wasn't unfinished business like it's been the last few years. It's, we're healthy. Nobody's missed a game yet, and we haven't lost a game yet. But uh, in gen generally speaking, the Grizzlies feel like that they've had a great offseason, keeping up with the talent in the West, and the only thing that can derail them is a, you know, a lack of help. You're struck by how much David Fisdale has already made a difference in terms of the attitude. The I mean, there really is, a, and it's media day, you expect it, but I do think there's a sense of enthusiasm that I didn't even necessarily expect. Well, he certainly comes off very prepared. Uh, David Fisdale clearly has a vision for what he wants to do, not only with style of play, but player development and managing, you know, a, an older team. Um, so I'm, I'm, I'm always impressed by that because, you know, you can compare that to first time uh, head coaches like Ivoroni. He, he just seemed kind of lost uh, when, when he got here, and obviously that didn't work out. But Fisdale uh, is a very confident coach, and it has every right to be. Uh, he, he's prepared a long time. In terms of the injuries, hard not to be confident. I mean, Mark sounded like he says he's going to be a better player, whether that's true or not. He says he's in better shape than he's ever been. He's going to be a better player. Mike Conley's healthy. Basically, people are healthy except for Jordan Adams, the mysterious Jordan Adams. But then it gets to Chandler Parsons, who's not really doing much, no timetable. Yeah, that to me is the one potential issue here. Like I, I'm to the point where I don't expect him ready for opening game. Oh, me neither. It, it doesn't sound like they presented that kind of optimism. And what you really hope is that this turns out to be a much better signing than Vince Carter. I don't think Vince Carter was necessarily done. Vince Carter was hurt when the Grizzlies right. signed him. And so that's what they, the Grizzlies have done. They, they've signed a, a player who's hurt, who's had his challenges with rehab, uh, because I think that surgery should have had him back on the court a lot sooner than yeah. now. And so, you know, that's, that's a reason to be pessimistic. It's the one sign of trouble in an otherwise optimistic day here at the Grizzlies.